Hi everyone, it's Tom from Overpick and tonight I would like to show you how to add simple email signature to your Mozilla Thunderbird. Uh, email signature to your outgoing emails so it looks like this simple example. I've chosen this simple example because not only I would like to show you how to add this to outgoing emails but also how to create one in HTML. So, starting off, uh, as I mentioned, this is done in HTML. So the code looks like this. I'm not, I'm not going to have time, unfortunately, to go exactly through the code and what stands for what. But um, for those who haven't got any knowledge about HTMLing, I would focus only on the uh, um, various areas like uh, a text area uh, for for email. Uh, text for mobile, hyperlink to your website, uh, and uh, how to display logo below it. Um, and then after we create this, uh, it will take only a, a, a few seconds to add to uh, to add as your signature to uh, Thunderbird. So um, focusing on a code. Uh, starting uh, from the top, as you can see, this is my email um, address, and this uh, piece of text is uh, uh, displayed like this on your um, on your signature. Right below it, we have a uh, another contact detail, which is uh, my mobile, uh, which is over here as well. So obviously, you have to change these to 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 suit your details. And underneath it, we have a hyperlink to my website. You can see in here. So you would have to put your uh, hyperlink to your page over here. Say from there to there. And obviously change this uh, text uh, to suit this address. And uh, again, below it, we have an image tag. Uh, which displays um, logo on email, which is this bit over here. Now, um, important thing: uh, this um, HTML, uh, this uh, image tag uh, displays the uh, uh, image that is available, as you can see, uh, on uh, on the internet. Uh, so, in in my case, uh, is uh, the logo, the image of my logo, uh, has been pulled out from from my website. So, um, um, how are you about to uh, change this? I guess um, uh, for the actual uh, uh, hyperlink to the uh, website, you probably know how to do it. Um, all you have to do is obviously open your website, and in in this example, just copy. Um, this is one of my websites I created last year. Um, just copy the uh, URL address and paste it over here. Exactly from there to there. Change the text. And as for uh, the uh, actually actual image logo, um, again back to your website. Um, by right-clicking on it, you can open that in a in a new tab window. This is, by the way, in uh, Google Chrome, so it will open a new window like this, and um, the hyperlink for this logo can be you, you can take it from here. Again, it's it's another URL, URL that you can paste. Uh, back into your signature over here. These two credentials are standing obviously for height and width. So bear in mind, um, not always this logo will be displayed exactly how you like it. Sometimes you would like to make it smaller, wider, etc. to suit this text if your email address is longer, uh, things like that. So you can change these to suit. And from this point, what you would have to do is file and save this 
um, into your uh, computer in location somewhere you get, where you're going to remember because this location we will need it in a few minutes to um, to add to Thunderbird so let's say um, you have created this uh, code um, now if you haven't got uh, any idea about how to do this uh, not a problem a snippet of this code you can find on my uh, website www.overpick.com and uh, if you go to the main page uh, you have to choose uh, from the top menu you have to go to uh, designer help designer help download and you'll see this tutorial in there and right below the video on the main page you'll also see the uh, code snippet for this so just please copy paste change these lines as I as I just explained it to you and then uh, save it somewhere on your computer so let's say you have saved it uh, in location that you do remember um, now going back to adding the actual code the uh, adding the actual uh, uh, signature uh, to Mozilla Firefox uh, all you have to do is choose the um, email account you would like to add to and go to this uh, menu button uh, in the top right corner go for options and another little menu will display choose please account settings being in account settings um, in in my case I've got here a few of my email addresses but for this tutorial I'm just going to pick the, t the very top one, the main one, so uh, you will have it um, displayed like this. If you have already add your emails, etc., everything working fine, all these boxes will be filled in. All you have to do is focus on this area in in here. This you can leave it blank. You don't need you don't need this to be here. In fact, if we Add our signature. Uh, this might be displayed out uh, automatically um, after we saved it all. Um, but all you have to do is make sure these two boxes are ticked, okay? And choose from here the location where you have saved your signature. This can be named however you like. It doesn't have to be signature. You can name your name, dot surname, whatever. Um, but Please find it there where, please find it there where you have saved it. Choose the uh, the actual signature and go open. It will appear like that, so it will display a uh, root path to your signature. Go OK, and from this point, you have added the signature. When you're gonna go, as I just did, hit the right button. Hit the right button. Oh, sorry. Hit the right button it will pop out and it will look like this with your logo and with your details as I mentioned um, the code is available on my website www.overpig.com however if you have uh, any further questions um, do not hesitate to, to, to drop me a quick quick email a few lines maybe you would like me to maybe you need to uh, create something more complex not a problem let me know I'll, I'll see what I can do to help you out and um, hope you enjoy, enjoyed my tutorial and um, thank you and good night bye bye